ever search frantically through your medicine cabinet for some aspirin for a headache or a bandage for your finger? If you were lucky enough to find what you were looking for, you probably promised that you would straighten things up someday. Well, it's time to do it. And it is important, too. Most of your family's injuries and illnesses are minor and treatable at home, but most medicine cabinets have become a confusing collection of obsolete pills, ointments, creams, tonics, and prescriptions. Here are some tips on how to create and maintain a healthy medicine cabinet. First, clean out the cabinet, discarding expired prescriptions, over-the-counter drugs, ointments, and creams after checking the labels on them. You should do this at least once a year and replace essential items. Wherever your cabinet is located, be sure it's lockable. Make sure the key is kept far from the reach of kids, making allowance for their climbing abilities. As for what medications your medicine cabinet should contain, make sure you have the basics. Most of these items are available over the counter. They don't require prescription. Pain relievers and fever reducing medications. Decongestants and antihistamines. Cough suppressants and expectorants. Sore throat lozenges and mouth medications. Antacids and medications to relieve diarrhea and constipation. Remember, you may need both adults' and children's dosages. Also, include a thermometer. A variety of bandages, such as waterproof, gauzy, and compression bandages. Prevention is still the best strategy to ensure your family's health, so be sure to stock plenty of vitamins and supplements for everyone, and hand-washing items to eliminate germs before they cause trouble. You can find most of these products as store brands in your favorite drugstore, supermarket, or discount store. Make a list of the items you need, then compare the labels of the retailer's store brands with the labels of the national brands. Next, compare the prices. You will see some big savings when you buy store brands, savings as much as 30 to 40 percent. Now, buying store brands has become the smart way to shop for many consumers. Remember, if you have any questions about the store brands on the shelves, talk to the store's pharmacist. They know all about the benefits and quality of the products you need for your medicine cabinet and first aid kit. This is Bill Brooks for Store Brands USA. For recipes, health tips, home and lifestyle ideas, subscribe to Store Brands USA. It's free and can save you money when you shop.